The father standing in the red corner, weighed in at 93.4. He's at 22, stands at 6 4. He fights Alex Stoke, fight Factory, and hails from Stoke on train. Alex, the Iron Fist Johnson! And his opponent, standing in the blue corner, weighed in at 93.3. He's at 29, stands at 5 10. He fights out of Team Greaves and hails from Radcliffe, Mitchell Maximus Richard! Your referee, Mr. Neil Hall. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back and it's about to go off here at Full Contact Contender 3. Mitchell Maximus Richards versus Alex Johnson and that's a mean looking stare down right there between these two big boys in the light heavyweight division. Yeah, I can't see this lasting beyond the first round in all fairness. Well, I hope he doesn't really. I want him to bang. I Mitchell Richards looks in great shape. He's looking much more trim than his last fight. He's been down at Team Greaves and they've given him a proper workout. Yeah, we know he was. You know how hard it was for him at last fight, losing the uh, title fight against McDermott. He looks in here to make amends. Big bombs from Alex Johnson. Mitchell coming right back out at him though. Yeah, some massive swingers, but I don't think they really caused Mitchell too many problems. Looks here for the sweep. Mitchell looking for that takedown now. He doesn't get it. Yeah, look for the shoot, up against the cage. It. He was put in this position by Brett McDermott. He was able to be patient, wrestle his way out. Let's see if he can do that against Alex Johnson. Johnson's a slightly taller man. He's got a bit more leverage. Mitchell turns him though against the cage. Yeah, good, powerful exchange by both. There's a takedown by Mitchell. He's got his man right where he wants him now, stacked up against the cage. We're going to see some ground and pound now from Mitchell Richards. Yeah, good twist and shaking by both men. Mitchell Richards saw a bit of momentum there, ducked his shoulder around and put uh, Johnson on his back and uh, now a good good position here to move and uh, take an advantage. Possibly look to pass that guard into side control and work some sort of submission. He's got his man flat now, he needs to posture up, get some leverage to land some shots. Yeah, what he doesn't want to do is allow Neil Hall to stand him up. He's in a nice position, he's got to try and work something from here. At least try and, try and get some points, try and uh, solidify dominance on the ground. Looking to posture up now, looking for that forearm across the throat, create a little bit of distance and throw that left hand. He's being told to work by Neil Hall and he is doing. Mitchell stacks up now. The legs of Johnson going up, he's looking for an armbar. And a big slam by Mitchell Richards. And a right hand and another one by Mitchell Richards. Yeah, great work there by Mitchell Richards, just was patient. Got Mitchell passes the guard now into full mount. And he's got plenty of time now to work here. This is exactly where Mitchell wants to be. Looking to push he's up posturing up to land some shots. Here comes the ground and pound for Mitchell, but his man's got out. Mitchell takes control again with the double under. Well, but over under control here in the cage now from Mitchell Richards. But Johnson did really well there. Waited, knew he was close to the ring. Oh, big shots here from Mitchell. Big rights and lefts. Oh, to the body from Mitchell Richards now. Mitchell looking for a standing guillotine. Perhaps looks to throw a knee up. Risk control from Johnson though. Good work to get out of that position there from Alex Johnson. Yeah, he's done well so far, Johnson. He's been in a few dangerous positions, but uh, he's showed some good defensive work there because we really thought Mitchell was in a dominant position. But, uh, you know, look at him now. He's putting pressure on Richards. Come through, weather the storm, and, uh, you know, let's see what he can do from here. It's Mitchell, though, trying to get that leg inside for a trip takedown. Doesn't get it, and he's controlled against the cage. Got some nice knees there by Johnson. Mitchell raising the leg to defend against those knees. Yeah, and, and uh, Alex Johnson's corner encouraged him to throw some more. He was accurate with the first one. Final 10 seconds of this round now. Mitchell's defending well, stopping those knees with the leg. And a very, very intense first round there between Alex Johnson and Mitchell Richards. And for me, Jez, Mitchell takes that first round. Yeah, very much so. I agree there. Um, well, so much for my prediction. You know, we're into the second, but... Uh, some great work by both fighters ended up on the ground uh, Mitchell was in a dominant position said that earlier that uh, Alex had good spatial awareness because he noticed that he was close to this side was able to get his feet leveraged up on the side and big burst of energy flip round sneak out the back and back onto the feet so yeah it was good uh, good awareness from Johnson escaping a dangerous position absolutely you know, when he had it there was some solid control shown by Alex Johnson but Mitchell was able to reverse the positions he did the damage that round goes to me 10-9 Mitchell Richards. Yeah, I agree with you there on that one, Brad. I think uh, Mitchell has certainly done enough to uh, solidify that, that round. 
Um, we'll be looking to see, uh, you know, where this goes. You know, it's a nice exchange, nice takedown attempts. It's had a bit of everything, really, that first round. <laughs> Referee Neil Hall just waiting for the cage to be secured before starting the second round. Here, here we Hall. go for round two. Alex Johnson, Mitchell Richards. Mitchell takes centre of the cage. He gets a jab off Alex Johnson. Johnson flicking that jab out there. Throws the uppercut, misses. Yeah, There's a bit of a wild uppercut there, wasn't he? He's looking to looking to find range, but again, nice, nice low kick there by Alex Johnson. Yeah, nice right low leg kick there by Johnson right on the lead leg of Mitchell Richards. He's got Richards guessing here now. Mitchell advances though and throws the bombs. Oh, he caught him there, the left hook. A nice right to follow up. And now it's Mitchell Richards with his man in the cage. Looks to toss his man over, doesn't quite get it. And now it's Mitchell with his back on the cage and Alex Johnson in control. Yeah, Mitchell was uh, sort of expecting uh, Johnson to just go flying, wasn't he? And was like, oh, hang on a second. Uh, but uh, yeah, he's, uh, he, he shows some dominance uh, once again. A real wrestling tug of war match here between both men trying to find uh, some sort of position. Good knee exchange there. Interesting to see that, that it's Mitchell Richards uh, winning this clinch battle. Now switching to look for a double leg and possibly a single. Johnson turns his man with the underhook. And a left, right. Johnson landing bombs now. Mitchell covering up well. Yeah, so Mitchell needs to keep his hands up. Oh, he's talking his man down in the cage. Mitchell happy taking these shots. Landing big bombs now is Mitchell Richards. He's yeah. going for the arm and guillotine now. Mitchell just uh, shrugged it off, didn't he, really? Covered up well. Johnson put in a nice full combo, but nothing really landed. Mitchell Mi stepped away and was like, yeah, come on, let's bring it. Mitchell Richards showing he has no respect for the power of Alex Johnson there. Taking those shots on the chin and beckoning him on for more. Yeah, got him pressed up and nicely against the cage now. Looking to get both eyes, arms, I say, with double hooks there. Neil Hall encourage him to, to do something here. Both men wandering back into the centre, break up and uh, back into... Both men landing shots. Mitchell something on the chin there, looks slightly wobbled. But he's answering back with shots of his own. That jab keeps flicking out from Alex Johnson. That's been his biggest weapon on the feet. Oh, Mitchell with a big knee and another one to the body. Yeah, great clinch there by Mitchell Richards. Gets two solid knees, follows up with a nice right left. Mitchell Richards doing work here. Again, controlling his man against the cage. Neil Hall asking for action, and Mitchell Richards answers by going for an inside leg trip there. You know, I think both fighters are going to be frustrated that they spent so much time in this position because neither one has looked, really looked for much. It's just to sort of lock in, and Neil Hall does well to break them apart. Oh, a big hook from Mitchell on the knee to the body. Another one. Right hands coming in now from Mitchell Richards. Oh, some great body shots. Oh, and a big left kick. More hooks from Mitchell. Mitchell throwing knees to the body, hooks to the head, power shots to the body, another big knee from Mitchell, Mitchell Richards unloading now, Alex Johnson covering up and firing back with a big right hand of his own. Yeah, Alex Johnson does really well there to survive that onslaught. More Come big back. shots from Mitchell, Johnson slipped on the punch there. Yeah, really put everything behind that and just carried, carried him through and put him on the deck. Wow, what a second round here. Alex Johnson and Mitchell Richards are leaving it all in the cage. My goodness. Yeah, both men really tough. Both have showed great offence, great defence, survival instincts from both men. <laughs> what a fight, Brad. What a, what a fight. I've got to give that second round to Mitchell Richards as well. But I have to say, on a couple of occasions, especially towards the end of that round, Mitchell left his hands down and he got caught, Jez. Yeah, he, he was close. He had Johnson pressed up to the left of us here. It was looking like it was unloading. I'll tell you what, Johnson unleashed a big, wild uppercut. I'll tell you what, if that had landed, that would have been over. Mitchell was just getting a little bit carried away. He needs to be a little bit more tidy, a little bit more controlled. Um, just, just wait for the right moment. But, uh, you know, look, looking strong there. Great, little, great hands, little dirty boxing right in that close quarters. For me, Mitchell Richards now needs to pick his shots. He cannot unload with reckless abandon like that. He's got to pick him. He's got to load up, throw the one power shot when he knows he can hit it. He's got to land sweet and get the knockout. Alex Johnson needs to concentrate on pumping that jab, but he's got to follow it with a big right, whether it's an uppercut or a hook. It doesn't matter. He's landed that right hand. He can do it again. He can win this fight. But as it stands, 2018 Mitchell Richards. Yeah. I know I've said it a, a number of times today, patience, but patience really is a virtue. And for the big bad wolf, he just needs to wait there and choose the right moments. And, uh, you know, he could find a finish. But at the same time, Alex Johnson's still got an arsenal there. Oh, and they're still trading shots here, these big boys. Johnson's slicking the jab. Superman punched by Mitchell Richards. He's just flying through the air there, wasn't he? 
This big man rocking through that right. Flying through the air with the greatest of ease. He lands with his fists and he lands with his knees. Mitchell Richards is throwing everything at Alex Johnson. Big right hand though from Johnson. Johnson looking a lot more comfortable, not a lot more collected in this final round. Oh, a big right hand from Johnson. Johnson looking confident here, but Mitchell lands again with the right. Mitchell chasing around the ring now, landing the big bombs again. He smells blood, doesn't he? He's just like, come here, I want some more of this. And come this is where Mitchell's going to pick his shots. Throw a nice, big, dirty boxing style uppercut under here, but he's been turned on the cage by Alex Johnson. This is a war of attrition now between these two men. Alex Johnson looking for head control. He's going to get that head just down low than Mitchell's, put it into his chest so he gets the leverage. Both fighters looking for some sort of control here against the cage, looking to implement some sort of clinch where they can start working some uh, takedown offence and some knees, but uh, a real struggle between both to get some, uh, get some significant upper hand. Nice knee there from Alex Johnson. Neil Hall. Neil Hall breaking the action now, and these guys going to engage again in the centre of the cage. Johnson throwing that jab out again. Mitchell covering up well. Johnson throwing these shots, but they're, they're all going the hands. That one landed, though. Yeah, the tables look to have turned with a nice body kick there from Alex Johnson. Mitchell really needs to respond here. He's blocking some of these. The up one and two are getting through there, and they're counting here for Alex Johnson. I think Johnson feels like the tides are turned. Mitchell really needs to come back, switch this round. He needs to close the distance and pick that one big power shot. Mitchell stalking his man. Mitchell as he cruised past a little bit of blood from the nose. Tries to come in, but Alex gets him with a nice jab to the face. And Johnson pushing his man against the cage now. Alex Johnson's winning this final round. But he needs a finish, surely. Yeah, he really does. Like we said earlier, we gave Mitchell the first two rounds and Alex had a great performance in his third. But I don't think it's enough. He needs to get a finish. He needs to put Mitchell Richards on his back. But I don't know if he's going to be able to achieve lights out here as Neil Hall breaks him up and brings him back again into centre. Last 10 seconds, the final exchanges. And Mitchell Richards is coming forward, landing huge hooks. A strong finish here for Mitchell Richards. Landing big bombs. Oh, it's over. Incredible fight. Oh, another fantastic what a fight. fight. And there was I going expecting a first round knockout. Who am I? Who am I? Neither T, both fighters not willing to give an inch. Some great exchanges on their feet. And um, yeah, great performance. Be interesting to see which way the judges score this. Well, I thought it was 
Ladies and gentlemen, you're with us, Mitchell Mack. 